Hi, I'm Steve Hansen. Welcome to our virtual pick to light demonstration. Today we'll take a look at the pick to light process and review some of the latest developments in pick to light hardware and software. In the right application, pick to light adds a high level of productivity and accuracy to any fulfillment or assembly process. And it does this by removing the reading in the activity of picking an order. So instead of reading a paper pick sheet or looking at an RF terminal, the user simply scans the order barcode, which illuminates the lights in front of the product that needs to be picked, and the quantity is displayed. In this demonstration, the order will be represented by this tote barcode, and the light modules will represent the product location. So let's pick an order. I grab the order barcode and my scanner that's in my zone and scan the order and immediately the order is launched in my work area. So all I need to do at this point is go to where the light is, pick the quantity that's represented and confirm my action. I start at this location, make my pick, confirm. Pick one at this location. And go to my last pick in this area. I pick two and confirm. Now the order is complete in my area and the bay display, which is positioned about every 10 feet, will always show me the order status. Show me what order number that I'm picking, whether it's complete or needs to be passed to the next zone, and it'll also prompt me at the start of the process to log into the system. Very fast, very intuitive, and accurate. And in the right environment, we typically expect that the impact of pick to light is going to be about a 30 to 50% increase in productivity and throughput. Some of the new developments in pick to light over the past few years have been new light module hardware that's easy to install, it's easy to move around, and it has very low power draw. But probably the most exciting developments in pick to light have been the new Lightning Pick software features that give the user full visibility to order status, throughput, and productivity all in real time. In general, pick to light can be applied to a wide variety of industries and applications. If we looked at your specific product requirements, we would want to understand your existing process, your number of SKUs, and your order profile. And once understood, we can quickly explain if and how pick to light can be effective for you. Please give us a call or contact us. We'll look forward to talking about your particular application. Welcome to ProMap. It seems a lot warmer than it did in 2019, and the traffic was nothing compared to last time. My name is Pete Gerbitz, and I'm with Matthews Automation Solutions, and I'm going to talk to you a little bit today about the LP Put solution. It's a put to light solution typically used in e commerce sortation. With a put to light system, large batches of orders are initially picked. These batches are commingled and need to be sorted at the put wall. On our put wall here, we have 11 different bins or put locations. So we can accommodate up to 11 orders to sort here. That size is configurable based on what your unique requirements are. Each light module has a confirm button and there is a message display to convey additional information to you. A barcode scanner is used to scan the SKUs and put them to the individual places. Let's put some orders. First thing we're going to do is get a batch. Oh, here it comes now. This batch contains multiple orders that will be sorted into this put wall. These were picked prior. The first thing I will do is log in to my put to light workstation. Scanning my employee barcode, it welcomes me. And the next thing I will do is identify the pre-picked batch of orders to the LP put application. 
Now that it's been identified, it tells me which batch I'm working on and how many items I have to put. I begin by picking up the first item within the batch, scanning it on the, on the scanner. I put it in the appropriate spot and I confirm the put. Again, scan an item, put it in the appropriate spot and confirm that I have made the put. And then I continue on with the rest of the items within the batch. I'm out of items. And it says I have four left. LP Put software has the ability to assist you in inserting paperwork and customer materials within the order as well. In this batch, I have the packing lists to go with each of these orders. They're conveniently barcoded and that barcode is associated with the order. So I scan a packing list, put, confirm. Scan, put, confirm. As I complete these puts, the message display indicates to me that this order is done. And now I have picked all of the items within my batch and sorted them into single orders. As the last item is confirmed within the bin in the put wall, the message display illuminates done. As this happened, a light module on the pack side of the put wall illuminated to indicate to that operator that the order is now ready to be containerized and packed. Now let's go to the pack side. We've just completed sorting four orders on the other side of our put to light workstation. Now I'm around the back side, or what is sometimes called the packout side of the workstation. You can see I have four locations illuminated, and these are the orders that are completed so that we can finish. First thing I'll do is take a shipping container, and I select the order that I want to pack, take all of the items, place them in the container, and here it says Fed, so this is going to be shipped FedEx, and I'll sort it to that aisle. I confirm and one is complete. I go on to the next one. This one says UPS. I will take the items out of the bin, confirm, and that's complete. Here's our LTL line. Place the items including the packing list in the box. And finally our last item. And the system is now in idle. I have packed the orders within the batch that we sorted on the front side. I look forward to hearing about your specific application. The LP put solution is very configurable depending on your specific needs. The process that we just saw where we packed the orders from the back side of the wall can also be executed from the front side of the wall, eliminating the need for a two-sided work cell. Please feel free to contact us and let us know how we can help. Thank you for your time.